Good afternoon. Let's call Prattwood Planning Commission to order, please. Madam Secretary, would you call roll? Mayor Gillespie? Here. Councilman Bowles? Chairman Gardner? Here. Vice Chair McAuley? Here. Chief Johnson? Ms. Carpenter? Here. Mr. Hall? Mr. Nelson? Here. And Mr. Smith? Thank you. Let it be known that we do have a quorum. Uh, there was some July 18 mid, uh, minutes and August 15. Has everyone had a chance to read them? I have, and I move that they approve this issue. Can't say he doesn't have them. There was a motion. Do I hear a second? Second. Mm -hmm. All in favor of the minutes of the July 18th and August 15th, let it be known by raising your right hand. All opposed, like to sign. Motion carried. We got some new business. We got a final plat of Printer Brook Subdivision, plat number two, located off Printer Brook Drive, Trustmark Bank, Stone Martin Builders. Uh, Barry Simpson is the is the engineer. Um, Ms. Carpenter, if you will, would you please read that uh, uh -huh. Final motion. Final Brook subdivision plat to yeah, yes. October 17, 2013. Whereas Stone Martin Builders is the developer of Tindal Brook subdivision plat 2, and whereas the proposed development is located inside the city limits at the west side of Old Ridge Road, north of existing Glen Brook subdivision plat 1 and 2, and whereas the revised sketch plan for the proposed Tindall Brook Subdivision Plat 2 and Glen Brook Subdivision Plat 3 was approved on July 18, 2013, and whereas the preliminary plat of the proposed development was approved on August 15, 2013, and whereas the department heads have reviewed and commented on the proposed development. Now, therefore, be it resolved that the City of Prattville Planning Commission hereby gives its favorable review of the submitted final plat of Tindall Brook Subdivision Plat 2 Thank you. Do I hear a second? Second. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Rice, you want to tell us what you got? Yes, sir. We need to ask him if he's done. Is he done yet? Mm -hmm. All right, let's see what he got there. <coughs> okay. This is the second phase of Pendlebrook subdivision, but this is 2A. It was simply four lots coming off of the center, the center road in Pendlebrook subdivision. Um, which is Pendlebrook Drive. We, we had tried to plat simply these four lots uh, to give the interconnectivity from Pendlebrook to Glenbrook right now, really simply to uh, try to save a little bit of time. And, but during construction, we realized that we were having to install so much infrastructure in this section down here that it was, it was constructed as well. So that plat will be before you next month. So this one is simply these four lots at the intersection. That's all you like and are you saying? Sir? Is that all you you like in now, just those four lots? <coughs> these, these are the first four lots out of the 25 that oh, will be okay. added to Pendlebrook. Okay. Next month you will have before you an additional 11 lots right there okay. that we ended up constructing simply um, from a timeline and, um, and existing infrastructure that we had to install anyway standpoint. Okay. Uh, anyone else have any questions for Mr. Rice at this time? Are you, are you got paving to do that I understand. The, <coughs> it would have without this rain, the, all the curbing is in, all the base is down and paving equipment is on site and they were scheduled to start paving tomorrow morning. It'll be about a day and a half worth of paving out there and this rain will obviously change that a little bit, they won't start paying until Monday morning. Okay. But a bond amount has been submitted to the planning department and hopefully it has been found satisfactory. Okay. Thank you, Mr. Rice. Ms. Stephanopoulos? Yeah. Good afternoon, Planning Stephanopoulos. Commission Chairman. Uh, Mr. Duke was unavailable to be here this afternoon. And um, we uh, find no real complications with this subdivision. As you will note in your uh, file, you will see the overall Pendlebrook map that shows the total phase of phase two uh, to help you see what he was explaining earlier. And with the uh, letter that is uh, provided 
for uh, the bonds. I believe in the past uh, you have acted in the capacity of subjecting your approval to the acceptance uh, with the uh, bond amounts and terms. So we have those under review presently and we'll be satisfying that research within the end of this week. But to be legal, let, let me, uh, can I offer an amendment that we approve this uh, pending uh, agreement with planning department on bond amounts? All right. Do I have a second? Okay. All right. All in favor, let it be known by raising the right hand. It's passed now. Thank you. Let's go. That was the amendment, so let's pass the, amendment. the whole thing. All right. Uh, all in favor of the final plat of Pennerbrook subdivision plat number two? Uh, let it be known by raising the right hand. All opposed, like sign, motion carried. Second item of, the, of today is a uh, final plat of Glenbrook subdivision, plat number 3A, located off the Pennerbrook Drive, owner's truck, my bank, and stone marked builders, uh, Barrett Simpson, engineer. Uh, Mr. Rice? Well, hold on, well, I need to get this read in. Mr. Smith, would you read that in for us, please? I'd love to read it in. Resolution. Resolution, final plat, Glenbrook Subdivision, plat 3A, October 17, 2013. Whereas Stone Martin Builders is a developer of Glenbrook Subdivision, plat 3A, and whereas the proposed development is located inside the city limits at the west side of Oldridge Road, north of existing Glenbrook Subdivision, plats 1 and 2, and whereas the revised sketch plan for the proposed Glenbrook Subdivision, plat Three and Pendlebrook Subdivision Plat Two was approved on Janu July 18, 2013, and whereas the preliminary plat of the proposed development was approved on August 15, 2013, and whereas the city department heads have reviewed and commented on the proposed development, now therefore be it resolved that the city of Prattville Planning Commission hereby gives its favorable review of the submitted preliminary plot of Glenbrook Subdivision Plot 3A's and so moved. Thank you. Do I hear a second? Second. Second by Mr. Crawley. Uh, Mr. Rice. <coughs> this is the Plot 3A of Glenbrook Subdivision. These are the four lots that you just approved the final plot for coming out of Pendlebrook. Mm -hmm. This is the connection to the existing Glenbrook Phase 2, and that's what I was trying to get across with the interconnectivity, going ahead and getting that loop road in. And this is simply uh, 18 lots right here that have uh, also been constructed. Paving uh, will also commence on Monday, and likewise, the uh, bond, bond amount and a similar letter have been submitted to the planning staff. Any question of the commission of Mr. Rice? Can, um, may I like to offer an amendment that this be subject to planning department approval? Sure. All right. And I'll second that. Mr. McCall has seconded. All in favor, let it be known by you, uh, raising your right hand for this amendment. Thank you. All opposed, like sign. No opposed. Mr. Stefanari, any Comments? Thank you. Um, for the uh, final plat, Glenbrook subdivision plat number three, 3A, all approved. Let it be known by raising your right hand. All opposed, like sign, motion carry. Uh, anything on miscellaneous? Nothing on miscellaneous? Thank you. Motion. Thank you, both of you. Motion to adjourn. Sure. <laughs> You're right. We adjourn.